All right. This is for all my friends. Do I, I, I really didn't want to do this. I did want to know, though. So right off the bat, this bad boy was about $9 and some change. Already not a great deal. I'm not super impressed, if I can be honest. I will say, it's heavy. It's like it's a pretty uh it's a pretty heavy sandwich. Um yeah, nine dollars and some change. It doesn't smell that bad. Alright, I'm gonna go in. Honestly, this isn't that bad. You guys won't believe me. I mean, aside from the fact that you're literally eating like a heart attack, it really mm, isn't that bad. I will say, oh, this the mayo on mine is a little bit uneven. However. It really isn't all that bad. I expected it, like at least the chicken, to like taste like shit. But it's actually not too bad. Um, the chicken is actually kind of high quality compared to some of the other KFC chicken you can get, which is surprising. And they did put a fair, they put like three slices of bacon on there. And I will say, I got this from a KFC Taco Bell, not a normal KFC. I don't think that should, should make a difference, but yeah. I, uh, I didn't want to like this. I wanted to actually throw it away and waste $9. But I'm, I'm ashamed to say that I'm going to have to eat all this because it's really not that bad. Um, if anybody is curious, I mean, if you want to spend $9 on it, just to say you had it, like, uh, it's definitely um, not terrible. And you might regret your decision a little bit. But it's really not that bad. Like, it really isn't. So, let me see. Oh, it sounds dumb. But you are missing some bread. And Loki, what I think would tie together the sandwich really well would be like, if you're doing like. We think about like the Big Mac and how there's that like little bun in between, like the two patties. It almost needs something kind of like that. So like when you bite into it, all that grease and like mayo and cheese like has somewhere to like seep into. So I, I know this sounds dumb, but like it tastes fine. There's just no bread, so you're just kind of like eating a lot of grease. However, like, I don't know. It is literally like two chicken sandwiches, though. Like, it, it really does feel like heavy. Heavier, when I picked up the bag, because the lady at the, at the KFC, she was like super nice, and I was like, yo, I gotta try this. My friends need to know. And she was like, everybody's been trying this. But. It's better than the, uh, the Doritos I reviewed last time. So, that's an upgrade, at least. Um, what else would I say about this sandwich? Honestly, like, I don't personally care for pickles, but it could use some pickles. I feel like if you're a chicken sandwich guy, you're kind of going to want the pickles there or something. 
just like a little bit of tang because it's literally just like chicken, like bacon, cheese, mayo, chicken. So there's like, there's really not a lot of relief. And then from, like I said, I don't really like put pickles or like pickles on my sandwiches really. So for me, it's like whatever, but I, I definitely think that they should have done that at least like they do with like other chicken sandwiches. Cause otherwise it's just like, what's going on here? What's the point? But, uh, on a scale of one to 10, I'm going to give it a seven because it really doesn't taste that bad. The only thing that I'll say is that it was expensive. Like if it was like $7, I'd be like, yo, everybody and their moms better be getting the KFC double down. I will also say that I didn't have the sandwich when it first came out. Back in, what, oh that was, I literally wiped off my fingers. You, Cause you guys saw me wipe off my fingers there. I literally just touched it once. Like that, this is what I'm talking about. Like it's a greasy ass sandwich. Um, but it's, re it's really not that bad. Um, I definitely am going to feel like shit after I eat this. Um, I'm the, the the older one that came out in 2008 might have been worse. Um, but this one tastes fine. I mean, I don't think I've ever had chicken from KFC that actually tastes this good. Most of the time, it just like tastes like absolute garbage. This is actually not that bad. I'm not sure if they like stepped their game up or or something. But. I think, uh, again, like, it's insane. I can say that I've had it. I know it's not too bad. Honestly, like, I'm making the review for you guys. I'm a little disappointed because I wanted to not like it at all. So, um, now we know. But the KFC Double Down was not the abomination that we all assumed. I mean, obviously it's gross in concept, but eating it, it's like, well, I mean, I've eaten like a double quarter pounder. If I can, I go to Wendy's or Checkers, it's like on par with that. I'll even say like surprised about the quality. Did not expect it to taste as good as it did. I expected it to taste like absolute crap. So. There you go.